Hey guys, this is Cheaper Than You, and I wanted to show you my On The Cheap medical kit. Most of these items, basically like 80% of these items, I've bought from Dollar Tree, where everything is a dollar. You may not have a Dollar Tree, but you, you probably have somewhere that everything is a dollar. Anyway, this is a small little kit that is uh, just filled with band-aids. It was a dollar, has some alcohol prep pads, um, great, couldn't plainly of that, great to have, um, some scissors, these are foldable scissors, great for cutting galls and stuff, they're stainless steel, they just clip open, do some craft projects with these, I'm just kidding, they're not sterile, but they're great to have when you need to cut something in an emergency, okay, um, I have some antibiotic ointments, these were a dollar, um, some hydrocortisone cream, that's a dollar, some antifungal, um, I actually got this from the vet, this was not a dollar, this was actually from one of my pets, but it is for human use, read the directions, always read directions on the back, that's how I found out it was for human use. Um, I got some tape for a dollar, paper tape. Um, I have some gauze pads, 15 for a dollar. Um, I have cold pills. I have ibuprofen for fever. I have Maalox for heartburn, sour stomach, irritating damn things. I have some allergy pills, kind of like ibuprofen. If you, you get bit, you need some of this. You know, bugs or stuff, allergies, annoying things. You don't need to swell up like a balloon. Um, mucus relief. This is an expectorant. It's great for getting stuff out of your lungs. You don't want your lungs to fill up with fluid. I have a thermometer. Temperatures are dangerous if they get really high. Alright, I have some ace bandages. Great for keeping swelling down. Take a combination of an ace bandage and some Tylenol and your, your swelling may go down. Um, super glue. This is great for bonding skin back together on the cheap. It's probably not for you. Don't take my advice if you're, if you like to buy $10 things of skin bonding agent, go ahead. I'm not telling you how to spend your money. I have some uh, Tylenol cold head congestion daytime. Great to have. Cold congestion is annoying. I have some wet naps. These are from Buffalo Wild Wings. Doesn't really matter where they come from. They're great for cleanup. They're not alcohol pads. These are probably great for just just cleanup. Okay, don't use it on a wound or anything. Just if you got some blood here and there or something like that, it's great for just scrubbing that off. You don't want to walk around covered in blood. Um, I got some razors for removing hair. So if you have to use a staple gun or something like that, you just remove the hair and use a staple gun. Those are also great to have, staple guns. I don't have one yet. But my stepdad has one, and he has used it for his dogs. It's a veterinary one. He's used it for dogs. He's used it for my brother's head when he cracked his dome open. It was a pretty big slice to the face. Worked perfectly. We saved $1,000. Just saying, they're pretty nice to have. I can't pay $1,000 out of pocket. All right. Um, another thing. Get a drug guide. This has all, every freaking type of medicine you could think of. If you go order you some medicine off of like this uh, this website below, um, you're going to need one of these because if you get veterinary uh, supplies or veterinary uh, penicillin or amoxicillin or whatever, you're going to need to know what it's used for and used best for and you're going to need to know how much to take. Okay? Best friend right here. The name's always on the drug, 
or there's like some initials or something, this will help you find it. Another not so bad item to have is a terminology book. It's got pictures. It's got terminology. It's got it's got a I don't know. It's got all kinds of damn shit. It's got names for stuff. Names aren't so important. You just want to figure out what's going on. The nurse's survival guide. Complete clinical quick reference guide. This is an old ass book. I don't know. It's got some nice information. You know. It's got some scenarios and got some I don't know, it's a good read. Go ahead and read it. Um, I have some CPR books. CPR and first aid. Basic first aid. Let's look through this one. It's got some graphic pictures. Whoa. Just kidding. Um I'm certified in both of these. these. These were actually my books that came with me being certified. Get freaking certified. That's the best freaking thing you can do. Uh, go to your community community college and get your cards. They're great for if you have to babysit, be around kids. Um, it's great for if you have a job and you have that. It can help you out. Like Somebody choke on a hot dog around you. You're going to be right there. Knowing how to do the Heimlich maneuver. Um, and I have a nursing assistant care book. I mean, this isn't this is, doesn't have any uh, sterile procedures or anything in it, but um, it's great for if you're having to care for someone and it teaches you about repositioning someone so they don't get um, sores and it just it it teaches you how to keep people comfortable. Okay, like. I'm a nursing assistant. I'm going to be a nurse. Eventually. By the end of the year, I'll be a nurse. Hopefully. Let's just hope that uh, state funding is not getting cut. But, um, which I hear it might. But this is my customized kit. This is what I want. This is what I'm going to use. I mean, like, if I have the flu or I have a cold or something like that, I'm going to need some of this. I get cut in the yard all the time gardening. That's why I have all this stuff. Uh, you might have different needs, you know. Uh, you might have uh, extreme allergies to peanuts or something. Get you one of those, uh, to one of those uh, adrenaline shots. Um, those are expensive, by the way. Those are so freaking expensive. But, I mean, customize it to fit you. I don't have any major allergies. Actually, wait, I have an allergy to penicillin, but it's not very great. It just makes me uh, break out in a rash. But it's not, it's not life-threatening. But, um, just customize your own kit. Educate yourself. Try to save some money. One day there's not going to be a doctor around the corner. you got to wake up and take responsibility for yourself. You gotta take care of yourself and your family. You gotta think about them. You know. So. And this is cheaper than you. Have a wonderful day. Peace.